What's up team, Flex, this is again Amy, welcome back to my channel, welcome to Kick Up My Canal. So today I'm here to do a, a video that is highly requested from my friends and other people around me. My makeup videos are always very very simple, I always do step by step and show you guys how to do your makeup or how to do a simple basic makeup. But today we're going to do foundation like how to apply foundation foundation routine i always get the question like what how do you apply your foundation like what do you do to make your foundation look so smooth and your makeup look so beautiful so every time i do my makeup i always start from the beginning but for some of you guys sometimes the videos are too long and you don't have the patience to watch all that so today we're going to do basic i'm going to show you guys how to apply foundation like i always said when it comes to makeup it always starts with the base which is skin make sure you have a really good skincare routine to help your skin something that you know that works for your skin so right now i've already moisturized my face so i wash my face and sometimes i go with an exfoliation brush because when you have makeup on sometimes they make Makeup kind of goes in your pores I go with exfoliating brush I do face mask so I make sure I take good care of my skin um, before ever putting makeup on and also I always make sure I moisturize my skin also what I do I always make sure I use a cream that has SPF just to help protect my skin from the Sun even though we're in the winter season but I always like using SPF um, it doesn't matter. I use it throughout the year. So yeah, just to make my skin look really nice and put together. So now that I've moisturized my face with my normal um, moisturizer. So now I'm going to show you guys my two favorite foundation. I have a lot of foundation. But the one that I've been using the most these few days is the Milani Scream, um, Scream Queen Foundation. This is, is two. It's um, 520. Um, this is what I've been using. And I love also the... Makeup Revolution Matte Base Foundation in P14. Um, these are two of my go-to foundation. I do have a bunch of foundation I use, but these are like my go-to foundation. And if you have been following me since this, since the beginning of this channel, you guys know I love using the NYX Bond to Glow underneath my my foundation i just you just give it this really sun kiss glow and i really really loved it so this is something i always use and moisturizer you can look for any moisturizer but i always most of the time i use the nyx angel primer i do have a bunch of different different primer here but make sure you find one that is good for you and i really love this one so now that i've moisturized my face my face is moisturized and when it comes to brush okay you can either use foundation brush like this one this is the real technique brush i really love this brush it's really easy when it comes to applying makeup i love it you can also apply the makeup with sponge if you want to the only thing why i don't sometimes use sponge to apply my make foundation because sponge sometimes kind of like suck all the products but you have like different different type of sponge you have this micro fiber sponge when you use this one the product stays on top the product doesn't like the, this this um sponge doesn't suck the product like this one this one suck all the products but this one doesn't so i use foundation brush to apply and then i go in with the sponge if for example i apply a lot of makeup a lot of foundation and i want to get rid of some of the foundation i will go in with a sponge to make sure i get rid of some of the foundation or i will use the sponge to blend my hairline so that my hairline especially when i'm having wig or my natural hair so that it doesn't look so the foundation doesn't look cakey on my edges i'll use the sponge so you need your um, foundation brush sponge your primer liquid eliminator if you want to if not you don't have to and a foundation of your choice so now that i've explained to you guys all of this now let's get started so first what i'm going to do i'm going to take my foundation my primer a little bit go a long way because i do have an oily combination skin so i have also prime 
moisturize my skin and what i also did is i also used the the makeup revolution setting spray the oil control setting spray the matte finish i also use it on my face just to help control the oil on my face so i also use that one i always like to use it. it's an option so if you want you can do it but if you don't want to you can just go ahead and and moisturize your face and then put your primer and then if you want you can add liquid illuminator or you can just go in with your foundation if you want to it's not like compulsory i just love using um i love using liquid illuminator it just makes my skin my skin just looks so beautiful you guys this is just moisturizer and then now I'm going to apply the liquid illuminator. You're going to see how glowy my skin is going to look. I'm going to have this really nice, beautiful, sun kiss glow on my face. Go with the brush a little bit on the forehead. If you guys can hear the kids in the background, please excuse me. So if you have any place on your face that you need to color correct, color correct is using um, a, a orange concealer to color correct. I don't normally, I don't color correct because the foundation I'm using, i um, really covered a lot of places on my face, especially around my mouth area. I, t I tend to go in with the foundation, maybe um, a, a little bit more. To get the coverage but i don't know i don't always color correct so now that we've done that you guys can see how my skin look my skin look very very beautiful my skin look very flawless and it's really really nice so now i'm going to take my foundation and i'm just going to put few drops i don't really focus on my forehead because my forehead i'll just take whatever is on the brush and i'll just use that to blend my forehead so now i'm going to take the brush you're just going to do a bouncing motion just like bounce i like to focus around my mouth put the foundation there and then allow it to kind of cook bake as you guys can see and then now i'm just going to take the brush i'm going to blend the rest of my face you're just going to like do a dabbing motion just like bounce 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 so i take whatever is on the brush i go on my forehead so that also helped me not to get like the thick foundation on the forehead where it makes like your forehead is like your hairline has a lot of foundation it's kind of cakey i don't like that kind of feeling and also don't forget to go in with your foundation under your underneath your jaw you don't have to apply it on your neck but you make sure you want to make sure that underneath your jaw is also covered so that it doesn't look like you have like different skin tone even though my my neck is a bit darker than the rest of my face but when i go in underneath my my chin it's it's much more better the way the product will look so as you guys can see so now everything is blend smoothly i don't have a lot of foundation on my forehead just a little bit go a long way and also my mouth is kind of fully covered everything is blend really nice and very smoothly make sure you blend everything i'm gonna use the brush and just wipe and try to shape this unicorn brow so guys this is how you apply this is how you apply foundation it's very simple it's very easy after applying your foundation you can go in with your concealer um setting powder all of those goodies but you guys wanted me to show you guys how to apply a foundation and as you guys can see the foundation looks very very nice very very flawless i really love the look so team fullest
this is how you apply a foundation to foundation routine if you guys want me to do highlights and contour stay tuned for that video i don't want this video to be too long so i'm going to stop it here so this is how you apply your foundation symbol and i also went with a simple um eyeshadow like a really natural look with some false lashes today today's like one of the first time you guys are not like okay yeah first new video new year let's let's start doing lashes so this is it so team fullest this is the finished result with the foundation and then i went ahead and do a highlight and contour for you guys you guys that video is going to be up as well so foundation highlight and contour this is the finished result so let me know what you guys think of this look if you guys like this video please don't forget to like comment subscribe and share don't forget to follow me on my instagram my facebook like page all the links will be down in the description box if you have any questions let me know in the comment box if you have any other videos that you guys want me to do concerning makeup or any other thing that you guys want like a short video instead of making a full face tutorial let me know in the comment box and i will be glad to share to do it with you guys heel erg bedankt for your liefde and understanding thank you guys so much for your love and support and i'll see you all on my next video team fullest peace out bye